million other people with the same stuff. You really think you're different, man? You must be kidding. Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it. It's impossible. It's not probable. You're irresponsible. Too many obstacles. You gotta stop it, though. You gotta take it slow. You can't be a pro. Don't waste your time no more. Who the fuck are you to tell me what to do? I don't give a damn if you say you disapprove. I'm gonna make my move. I'm gonna make it soon. And I'll do it because it's what I wanna fucking do. Because all these opinions and all these positions, they come in in millions. They block in your vision. But no, you can't listen. That shit is all fiction. You're never gonna make it. Hello, everyone. This is Crimson. Your favorite favorite ever. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry. I just had something to drink. Anyways. Today, I am finally getting around to making uh, What If Deku was the reincarnation of our quite honestly beloved uh, identical gangster. The ruler of the High Hut Council, uh, or cartel, if you watch Star Wars Clone Wars. Uh, the leader of all huts, uh, the man who had his uncle murdered. Uh, well, at least in this time, it really is in his timeline. Jabba the Hut. That's right, I'm making what if Deku was the reincarnation of Jabba the Chedic Teacher. If you got if you if any Star Wars fans are watching this, uh, that's how you say his real name. Anyway, let's get into the video. We start with this. We start with this. The the story with Isuku being born. Isuku gave birth to Isuku, who, which don't worry, as a hutlet, he is adorable, and over time he is still adorable. Promise me. I promise you that. The doctor said. Um, uh, ma'am, I'm so sorry, but I think your son may have a birth defect. And without hesitation, is Inko Medoya backhanded that doctor, saying, Are you calling my baby ugly? As he's, as the doctor holding his face saying, No, ma'am, I'm so sorry, ma'am. I don't know what, what came over me. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. As uh, Inko say, hmm, don't you dare say that about my baby. As uh, Hashashi, and yes, I'm gonna make sure Hashashi is still here in this. As Hashashi hold his chest saying, my goodness, honey, I never seen you slap someone in the face before. As he say, nobody. Gotta talk smack about my baby. As uh, is as Inko say, hmm. And plus, this is common in my on my side, the family. As uh, as I should say, excuse me. As Inko said, uh, I have a brother. As he, he as I should say, I'm sorry. What? As Inga said, Yeah, I have a brother of the same quirk. As uh, Hassan said, Oh, wait, are you talking about that extremely, quite honestly, flamboyant cousin you, of, your, of yours that kind of looks like a gigantic slug? As, uh, as Inga said, He's not a slug, he's more reptilian like, but yes, that he must have inherited his quirk. As, uh, I was gonna say, actually that is quite common in most families. D, 37 in my case. As uh, Inga say, what do you mean? As he say, I say, my fire breathing quirk skip a generation or so. As uh, Inga say, really now? I say, yeah, my, yeah, in my, in my case, my, if we have twins, uh, one of them's going to have a fire breathing quirk. I had a twin. I have a twin, and it's also rare if the generation is supposed to skip it, that uh, we'll have a fire breathing quirk. Who knows? Maybe we'll have two quirks. And before you lot ask, uh, I will have him have a fire breathing quirk, but he will mostly focus on other things, uh, which so happens to make his fire breathing quirk. Uh, more effective, uh, so don't worry. 
I think it's like that's quite nice. So. As a, uh, hold on, guys. I'll be right back. I have to go on a walk. Sorry about that. But I read the time wrong. Anyway, so you have to say, well, I'm sure also would be a quite well powerful hero, but. Sai, as uh, it has to say, but isn't those with your cousin, I mean your brother type of quirk? Uh, what does that really do? As uh, Inka say, I, oh, well actually back then, uh, these people with his type of quirk, as he poke Izuku's cheek, they were fear and they are fear and renowned soldiers and warriors. Uh, as I was supposed to say, what happened? As I say, they kind of got fat and they said, and that's how I to become mob bosses. As uh, I was supposed to say, okay, how come he didn't tell me any of this? Uh, as uh, Inka say, I wanted to, uh, I didn't want to, oh, be right back. Sorry, my mother called me. Anyways, what was I? Oh, yes. As Inka say, I do not want to have Izuku or any kids we have, uh, or us, quite frankly, apart from that uh, mafioso business. As, uh, let's just say, okay, but for now on, at least tell me anything about your family or your family drama because I'm quite concerned because. I, we know about the Huck Cartel. As uh, years went on and Isuku has shown to be actually quite strong, durable, and smart. Uh, he even took on a couple of martial arts uh, that would help his uh, slug like body in battle. And he's been practicing his fire breathing a bit. And the uh, muscle art style he took up was, uh, well, quite frankly, a uh, viper style. Or, as people call it, the sound and snake style. He's, he used to adapt to situations since he doesn't have legs. Uh, but he's supposed to be quite fast. In fact, uh, in fact, his speed uh, surpassed and right for Ila's entire family. Izuku is also quite intelligent, uh, like how he is in canon. But, uh, like Izuku in canon, he's very too humble and kind to accept any compliments. Even though what he has shown, he can be one of the most powerful and gifted heroes. On his first day of kindergarten, Izuku introduced himself as I as Izuku, but he was speaking in the hut tongue, which is his family tongue. As the teacher asked, uh, sweetheart, can you speak English for us? As Izuku do know, do know quite a bit, a lot of English, and. Uh, Hatties, as you could say, oh, uh, sorry, I always speak in my family's native tongue, uh, so, around them, so I'm not very used to speaking, used to speaking English. Hello, everybody. I am Izuku Tuchelek Tusser Medoya. As, uh, as what you say, Tuchelek Tusser? As Izuku say, on my fam, on my mother's side, uh, my family has a lot of half names that have either a lot of J, S's, or I's. I have both. So, so, so I was named Izuku to check the church Midoriya. But, but my parents used to call me a hut. So, so if you like, you all can call me 
eat Zukita Hut. As uh, I want to kiss a. Do you have a mutation quirk? As he look at himself, say, "Well, hold on, guys." Uh, Anyways, uh, sorry guys, I had to close my door so I can have enough uh, surround sound to talk. Anyways, Yusuke said, uh, well, yes, uh, it runs on my mom's side of the family. My uncle has th has this quirk. They call it hurt. It, uh, it may not look much, but it is my taste quirk, uh, but I also have superb strength, speed, and durability. But I also have a another quirk which I inherited from my dad, which is fire breathing. As a teacher say, well, Medoya, that is an interesting quirk, but wouldn't that make you a fire breathing slug of some kind? As Izuku say, actually, my family has a really common misconception. My, on my mother's side, we're not slugs. Uh, we more akin to lizards, uh, like iguanas or that type of stuff. Uh, as uh, one of the rude kids, aka Katsuki Bak, goes to say, eh, "Then why do you look like a gigantic slimy slug?" As uh, Isuku say, "Ah." Uh, I honestly don't know. I just say I can't. I just say that's how that's how the mutation quirk ca possibly works for my family. As did you say, Mr. Buck, I say, Bucko Kuski, that's a very rude thing to say. As it's to say, no, 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 that's it's actually completely alright. In fact, uh, my 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 mother's side of my family is kind of weird. In fact, uh, if I my quirk, if I my family's, my mother's family's quirk uh, is on my mother's side, uh, with my uncle to be more specific, this mutation quirk allows us to be hermaphrodites. As the teacher looks struck as uh, she asks, "How do you know what a hermaphrodite is?" As you should say, I read books uh, on occasions uh, as uh, Bug Go say what's a hermaphrodite as the Sukh say uh you don't want to know as uh, the teacher say you may sit down okay class uh, let's all uh, start with a very important lesson about quirk uses and first we're gonna leave this one if off uh, Hope you guys enjoy uh, the first part of what Deku was the reincarnation of Joey the Hutt. I'm gonna start the uh, start of the birth and the first day of his daycare years. Uh, so we can get a full gravita of how it will play out. Uh, I hope you like this new style of mine. So this is Crimson, your favorite Fire Ever, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye now!